everybody. I'm back with practice of the week. This week was all about the legs. So um, we're going to get started. Make sure I'm going to do right side as usual. And then next time when you come back, when you rewind it, do, a, do the same practice on the left side, with the left leg forward. Okay, so let's get started. Starting at the top edge of your mat, stretch up tall. Inhale the arms up. And exhale, fold forward. Make sure you're warmed up a little bit. Inhale, halfway lift and lengthen. And then exhale, soften your knees and step it back to plank. Lower down from plank, knees, chest, and chin, or chaturanga, slowly. Pushing off of those toes, inhale through to upward facing dog. Chest comes forward, shoulders down and back. And then exhale to downward facing dog, sinking into the heels. Looking between the hands, we're gonna step the right foot up between the hands and gently lower your left knee down, uncurl your toe, and then inch your right toes up. If you need to pick that foot up, because you wanna make sure your knee winds up over your ankles. Take your hands to your thighs, take a big inhale, and then on your exhale, sink into that hip and knee. We're gonna take the hands behind the back, holding opposite elbows to give the chest a little stretch while we do a little heel raise. We're gonna work a lot with the calves today. So draw the shoulder blades together, opening the heart, and then just a little lift with that front heel. So take a big inhale, we're gonna lift, and then exhale and sink. One, inhale, lift, so it's a tiny little move, exhale, sink, two, and keep going. Three, four, five, try to sink a little deeper, six with each little drop, seven, but really focus on the calf, eight, it might shake a little, that's okay, nine, and ten. Good, drop the heel, inhale the arms up, and exhale, fold forward. Back toe curls under, we lift that knee, and we step it back through the plank. Lowering down, elbows in, push off of those toes, inhale, up dog, and exhale, down dog. Drop your head, shake it out, make sure your neck is relaxed, look between the hands again, and this time we're gonna step the right foot up, and the left heel is gonna stay down. So, setting up for warrior one. Press into your right foot, inhale your arms out, up and back, and exhale, sink into your hip and knee. Keep everything square towards the front edge of the mat, which might require you to kick that left foot out to the side a little more, that's fine. Back leg of that left leg is gonna stay straight and strong, reaching up, a big inhale, and exhale, and sink down. And then take your hands again behind the back, holding opposite elbows, or as close as you can get to the elbows. And then it's a little lift and a dip, so we're gonna inhale, lift the heel, and dip, one, same move, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This time on ten, we're going to hold it up for five, four, three, lift it higher, two, and one, drop the heel and open to a warrior two. Now you need to kick this foot back a little so they line up. Arms out to a T, reach and lengthen. Inhale, lift the hands and the heel. One, two, inhale as you lift, exhale as you lower. Three, four, five, six. Try to sink a little deeper each time. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. Try to hold this one for five, four, three, two, one. Drop the heel and take it to side ankle. Forearm to the thigh, top arm comes up and over. Really extend and rest lightly. So leg and torso do the work. And then we're going to take this top hand behind your back and the bottom hand behind the back and hold opposite elbows. Roll that top shoulder open towards the ceiling. Sink a little deeper into that front hip and thigh. Press into the heel, try to relax your toes and really use your leg and your torso to hold this. Taking gaze up towards the ceiling. Sink a little deeper, keep the back leg straight. Release your arms, press into the legs to inhale, come up and exhale, reverse forward. So back hand's gonna slide down, heart opens towards the ceiling. Breathing and sinking a little deeper. Taking another big inhale. On your exhale, windmill the hands down to the mat, to either side of your front foot. Spin out to the ball of the back and step it up. Exhale, fold over your legs. Inhale, lift halfway. Exhale, fold back down. Wiggle your feet together so they're close, side by side, hip width apart, or big toes are touching or nearly touching. And then soften your knees and inhale and roll up. 
We're going to exhale to chair. So heavy in the heels, heavy in the hips. Peek down. Make sure your knees are even with each other. Your hips are sticking out and your knees are not extending over the toes. Relax your jaw and your forehead. Extend those arms up, reach up, nice big inhale. On your exhale, sink deeper and take your hands behind the back. We're going to pedal the feet. So little lifts of the heels one at a time. One, two, three. Your knees might come a little further forward. Try to keep them back. Five as best you can. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're going to go for ten more. Ten. Shaking's okay, nine, burning's okay, eight, seven, no sharp pains though, six, five, keep your abs engaged, four, three, it's a little move, but it's brutal, two, um, one, hold both of those, feel up just an inch, drop your hips, lift your heart, three, two, one, drop the heels, inhale the arms, up straighten the legs, good work, exhale, back bend, press into the feet, inhale up, exhale, forward, Inhale, lift, halfway length, and exhale, soften the knees. Step or hop back to plank. Lower down, elbows in, knees, chest and chin, or chaturanga. Push off of those toes. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, back to downward facing dog. Sink into the heels. Walk your hands back if you got a little long. Take a quick little breather. We're going to do one more. Looking between the hands this time, we're stepping the right foot back up, and we're staying on the ball of the left foot, so coming up to a high lunge. When you're ready, press into your feet, inhale your arms up, and then exhale, sinking down. Sinking into that hip and that thigh, keeping the back leg straight and strong. We're gonna do a dip and a heel raise. So we're gonna take the hands behind the back first, hold opposite elbows again, stretch your chest, shoulders down and back, and then we're dipping and lifting. One, two, three, Fours, try to sting straight down. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, on ten, hold it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Drop the heel, inhale the arms up, and exhale, fold forward over those legs. Step that back foot forward. Inhale, straighten your legs, look up and stretch up. Exhale and fold. Soften your knees. Inhale, roll back up. Take your arms all the way up overhead. Reach up and stretch up. Take a little back bend on your exhale. Press into your feet. Inhale, come back up. And exhale, the hands down to the heart. Awesome job. I will see you next week. Make sure you do the other side, the other left, foot, left leg forward. Namaste.